and that we need to resurrect African history, African civilization, so that we can know who we are. You know, you can't tell me you know who you are by studying someone else who is giving you a narrative of your own history. How in the hell can someone tell you who you are when they start your history off during the worst period of your entire historical journey? African people are the oldest people on the planet. So how are you going to start African history for black Americans with the transatlantic slave trade mm -hmm. and then start world history at, with European uh, civilization? You know, so these are the things that the Black Achievement Fund intrinsically is fighting against. And we have a, the most simple solution for black economic independence for self-determination. And it is 10 million black people and our allies. It's over 50 million of us in America. So one in five. 10 million black people and our allies plus $9 a month equals $90 million every single month and over a billion dollars a year for us to finance the grand development of black America. To that end, since uh, June of 2020, we've been collecting contributions. We have a little over 3,000 members and supporters. We have members in all 50 states. We have about four dozen members internationally. Um, the Black Achievement Fund has 12 program departments that range from real estate development, health and wellness, um, grants and scholarships, small business, uh, food and agriculture, manufacturing and transportation, um, uh, uh, international affairs, so on and so forth. All of our programs and services are free or at cost to members of the Black community, um, members of the Black Achievement Fund. And our goal is to establish economic independence so we don't have to rely on anybody else to do anything for our communities. We're three years old and we've already owned six acres of land to build our very own uh, members retreat in Toomsboro, Georgia, two hours south of Atlanta, um, under contract for to purchase another 94 acres adjacent to the Black Achievement Fund, six acres. I also owned another 12 acres over there. Another Black Achievement Fund member owns 17 acres and another Black Achievement Fund owns six acres. So we're in the process of creating a Southern uh, hub for uh, Black culture here um, in, in Atlanta, uh, well, south of Atlanta. So all of the things that we're doing, we're doing collectively. So the land that we bought, we bought the land collectively. It's owned collectively. The land is in the Black Achievement Fund's name. So that's the whole idea. And every single month, we we'll generate 90 million to finance this ongoing development agenda, to finance. And within this agenda, all of these program departments get allocated a certain portion of that billion dollars a year.